Now, he didn't say anything directly, but I got the strong impression that something happened between you both. <sighs> Lauren, if this is the case, you need to say something to me. This is ridiculous, and frankly, it's none of your business. He cheated on me with you. He left me for you. And as crazy as this might sound, the last thing I want is for him to get hurt. We haven't done anything to raise, I promise. Really? Because I think Ned thinks differently. And there must be a reason for that. <sighs> OK. OK, look. A while back, we were in Ned's shop and we were um, <clears throat> looking through some designs and we were alone. And there was a spark. It was tiny and it, it certainly wasn't physical. But it was there. Yeah, uh, uh, and I shut it down in a flash. But clearly it meant more to Ned than it did to me. Yeah, but if you feel like this is something you have to hide... Yeah, but only because of who Ned is. Look, I want Ned and Brad to have a good relationship, I do, but all of us living together is doing my head in. I'm constantly on edge, and I know Brad's picking up on it. Oh. I don't know what to do. Yeah, well, you have to do something. Because if you let it continue, your marriage is going to be in big trouble, Lauren. <laughs>